Hello there everyone and welcome back to another video and today I'm going to be doing an unboxing video on this box This has some very special items to me and um, Yeah, I'm here to showcase them. So yeah, anyway, let us begin So um, yeah, I haven't actually I should probably have opened this box a little bit before but I didn't so that's gonna be a problem this is uh, this is actually kind of difficult okay Here we go. My cat. Okay. Now we get to the good stuff. So, I've already spent a minute unboxing this. So now, let us get into the actual stuff. Also, um, there's my cat. Just going around. She's licking the camera, God. There is. Yeah. So. Okay. Let us open this. And, um. It's in bubble wrap. That's just. That's just perfect. I'm gonna take out this first item. It actually works. That is so cool. I'll, I'll get my old one out, which is in um, a little bit worse condition. As you can see, the roof, I had to repaint the roof because this roof would just, it fell out. But now I have two. One is in way better condition. Look at the face. Oh, that, that's incredible. Also, I'm gonna showcase all the items once I'm done. I'm gonna take this one out next. I think you can probably already see who this is. It is Duck. And, um, oh, look at that wheel. It's a little bit, it's a little bit white. I, I could probably just repaint that. But yeah, here is Duck. Looking incredible. I really like the 2014 duck. So that's really cool. Put him next to the troublesome truck. Okay, so next item. Which item speaks to me now? I think this one. I think you can already see most of these items. But here we have Jack. The front loader. My cat wants to be let out. I don't know if I'm, I'm gonna keep that part in the video where I let her out of the door, but um, yeah, I just did. So anyway, here we have Jack. I desperately need more road vehicles, so it's real nice to have him. He's in decent condition. Got some scrapes on him. I, I love this mechanism where you just... You can also move it without having to lift it. So that's that's also pretty cool. Okay, so that's... That's Jack. What is this? That's just on paper. Okay, this one's cool. It is Trevor. This is from 2003. And look... The fly whale actually works. I have an ad adventurous Trevor, but uh, this one is pretty cool. This is in really good condition. Most of these items are actually in pretty good condition. Speaking of more road vehicles, here we have uh, Max. I, the seller I bought this these toys from uh, didn't have Monty, but I, I'm so happy that I got Max. So this, I guess this is um, 
season six accurate somewhat. But yeah, I only have Max, I don't have Monty. Like I said, that's season six accurate, but look at that face. I'm so happy to have him. Uh, let's just try and end off the road vehicles with... Um, oh, this one is actually... Oh, uh, Byron. He has the same mechanism as Jack, so they can like... I can high five. That's pretty cool. I like that. I I, I really do. So yeah, this is Byron. I actually have a funny story about Byron. My best friend IRL. Yeah, I have re real IRL, IRL friends. Don't be surprised. He actually had a wooden rally Byron. So I remember I always always went to his house and played with toy trains with him. And I always loved Byron because I didn't have him. But he sold all his toys, including Byron. So now I'm happy to actually have my own Byron. So that's cool. And the last the last two items here is just a stock stand 2003 James Tender. Uh, you might be wondering, why did I get a 2003 James Tender? Well, I didn't actually mean to get this Tender. Um, you'll see why in a later bit, but I didn't mean to get that Tender. And uh, the last item for this top row is a Sodor fuel tanker. Oil car, I mean. I meant oil. Fuel and oil, almost the same. It's almost. So, next item with the bottom row. I'm gonna start off with a similar item. Here we have the normal troublesome truck that just... So that's cool. Now I have both of these two little nuisances. I have the giggling troublesome truck and the regular troublesome truck. I like that. Now, uh, next item. I'll take this one. I think you can see who it is. Is I'm so happy that I got him because it was either getting this version of Ryan or getting the wood version. And I really wanted the Mattel normal one. Really good looking model. I don't know, I, I don't like the way that they just reused Thomas's body, but I, I've, I'm just happy that I have Ryan. Speaking of, well, not really, but seeing as we continue with purple engines, here we have a lady. This is from 2006, I think. Really good face. She actually has a door now. Really good model. I, I I like Lady. She's cool. I think I'm gonna just take these two out at once. Yes, finally. Here we have Molly. Really happy. To have her now. She is one of my favorite Hit Era characters. I am. I love Molly. It looks like she's from 2008 with a 2009 tender. I don't really complain. I'm not gonna complain. So, funny story. I'm gonna do some story time. Once, a long, long time ago, I was in London. This was a real long time ago. And I bought two wooden railway tank things. And those were the Giggling Troublesome Trucks and Molly. I vividly remember the day I got these two in my hotel room and played with them. I, That was one of the best memories ever. So it's nice to finally like get those two back. I, I love Molly. She's cool. Well, seeing as we have James's tender. Here is... Mattel James. So when I said I didn't mean to get the 2003 tender, I meant I wanted the um, 2013 tender, but um, the seller gave me this one instead. I, I And I didn't really bother to complain because I thought she probably doesn't have the other tender. But then 
the seller like updated one of the pictures and the, she did have the 2013 James Tender. She just gave me the 2003 one. So I felt like, God damn it. What is this? What? Whoa. Oh, I did not. I forgot I bought this. This is Toad. I completely forgot I bought this. What? I... For, for a moment, I thought this was the spiteful break van, but no. I completely forgot I bought this. Oh my. I only used to use the Brio Toad, but now I actually have this one. Really nice item. And then again, let's... To go along with Toad, I bought... I ended up buying the 2013 Oliver. I, I I have a old style Oliver, but I never had like the 2013 one. So now I have a regular Toad, another Brio one, and a new Oliver. Really like this duo. They're not really underrated, but um, there goes my cat again. She wants to get back into the basement. There. Sorry about that. It's my cat again. So anyway, let's continue on with the uh, Iron Bert. Yeah, Iron Bert. The way I can tell these two apart is from the beard. Like Ari. Ari has like no no stubble. Well, Bert has like a bunch of stubble. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, she likes my trains. Okay, seeing as I just had Bert. Here we have Ari. Okay, so these two were actually in really good condition. Bert more so, but yeah. They do have some scratches because, like, these are 10-year-old toys. Definitely 10-year-old. Maybe maybe almost 20. Well, not almost, but, you know. So, uh, let's... Oh, this sounds cool. There was only one old-style engine in this lot. And that was Coldy. I really wanted a Coldy. Because I have some plans for him. Like, what, what's the year is this one from? It's from 1998. That's pretty cool. His uh, he has a tiny face, and um, an even scarier one on the back. But hey, hey, I'm not complaining. Not complaining. Uh, seeing as this guy fell out, I think I'm gonna take him. Here we have Fergus. The 2017 Fergus? Yeah, 2017. Here we have the 2017 Fergus without the red inside there. Sim it's a similar story with James. I originally wanted the old style Fergus. That face is creepy. I originally wanted the old style Fergus, but the pictures the seller had was only the new one. And I bought this one and... Um, she ended up updating those pictures, and she did indeed have the old one. So that kind of made me a little bit mad. There. No. That's my camera. No. She likes to bite my feet sometimes. Sorry about that. Anyway, I think I'm just gonna showcase our number one engine himself. Oh, God damn it! This Thomas was in really good condition, but she gave me the one with no eyebrows. That's a bummer. 
I wanted a Thomas with eyebrows, but this one is in better condition than my normal one. So that's something. <laughs> Everybody's favorite. Billy. This is a 2008 Billy, I think. Yeah, 2008. He has a very loose head problem probably because people have been trying to break his head all the all these years so uh it's explainable kind of weird though okay and um ah oh, that's a nice face here we have the um Here we have the Tommy Gordon. This is, once again, a similar story to Fergus and James. I wanted a 2003 one, but this time it's kind of like a reverse. She had a picture of the 2003 Gordon, and... Chill. I don't know what she wants, but um, yeah. She had a picture of the 2003 Gordon, I wanted that, but she sent me a picture of all the engines to make sure so that she got it right, and um, she originally had a knockoff Gordon in the picture, and I was like, no, I want the original one, and th then she replaced it with this Tommy Gordon, and I was like, do I really want to complain more, so I just opted to just get the Tommy one, the Tommy one is a little bit rarer than the normal one, so I'm not complaining, I'm not complaining, the face... It's not too bad. It just looks like Henry. <laughs> and that's a little bit weird. The final two items are two items that I don't have in my collection already. Uh, this one is a stock standard 2003 Percy. Really happy to get this one. And the last item is an item that I've been saying that I want for so long. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Wooden Railway Toby. I'm so happy that I finally have him. I've been wanting a Wooden Railway Toby for like so long. And now, I finally have him. The only engines that I was missing for years was Duck and Toby. I got Duck not too long ago, probably like five months ago, I got my wooden railway Duck. But now, I have Toby. I now have all the characters from 1 to 12. That's... I'm so happy. This is... Probably one of the best days of my life. <laughs> this has been an insane lot. Now then, let me let me just clean everything up and let's do an overview. And here is everything I got. I'm not going to say how much I paid for this. It wasn't that much. But uh, yeah, I'm really happy about this lot that I bought. All these engines I didn't have before except um, 2003 James Tender. But yeah, I gotta say, pretty good lot. If I had to say what my favorite item from this lot, I'd probably have to say like Toby. Really happy to finally have a normal Toby. He's going to be put good use in my next video. I'm not going to spoil it, but um, October is coming near. So uh, that's all I'm going to say. Anyway, peace out.